Thanks very much indeed. Well, I've got two massive stars standing beside me. I feel so honoured. I've got Chris Everett and Maria Sharapova. And I guess, Chris, let's talk to you first. What an amazing day to be celebrating 40 years of women's tennis when you guys broke away and took control of your destiny and told the men we can do it on our own. You're talking to me because I'm the oldest and I've been, I was there in the beginning. Although I was a teenager, I didn't know what the heck they were doing. I was 16 years old and I was hearing about women's liberation for the first time. I didn't, I saw bras being burned on TV. And, but Billie Jean, you know, she had a great vision and she could see the whole picture and she fought for equal prize money. And now as a result, you know, every, all the four Grand Slams have have equal prize money and I think it bled into other aspects of life you know like business and politics and everything else with women and you I guess you were one of the first glamour girls you had such an amazing rivalry with Martina as well I mean do you think that's kind of a little bit missing from today's tennis the rivalry uh, part? you know I think it helps I think it, it's great when you get I, I do think there are some rivalries actually I think the top three women are very are very very close and you have Maria staying next to you you have Victoria Azarenka and Serena I think they sort of um, stand apart from the rest of the crew, but I think it, it will happen eventually. It'll get even more intense, and I think uh, everything helps in tennis, the beauty, the glamour, the great tennis, and I think we have it all now.